Automatic by Harry Benjamin. Today's topic is leg length discrepancy. Having realized that a patient walks with a short leg gait, the next question is whether this is true or apparent. This diagram shows the landmarks for these measurements. Namely the tip is sternum, the anterior superior iliac spines and the medial malleoli, from the tip is sternum. To the medial malleoli is the apparent leg length. And from the anterior superior iliac spines, to the medial malleoli is the true leg length. Apparent leg length discrepancy is often caused by fixed deformity. If a leg length discrepancy is true, is it tibia or femur? This can be determined by the Galeazzi test between 3 and 18 months of age if unilateral or the Weber Basto maneuver, and if in the femur is it above or below the greater trochanter. Above the trochanter, the common causes include trauma, coxavara. Perthes disease, slipped capital femoral epiphysis, osteoarthritis and dislocation. Below the trochanter the causes include trauma, malunion and growth arrest. Bryant's triangle and the Latin's line are often used to determine whether shortening is above or below the greater trochanter. Don't forget to subscribe and like.